So, good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, and our students about to be graduates. My name's Orji Cumberford. I'm the principal of Edinburgh College, and it's my great privilege to welcome all of you here today, including the friends and families who I'm sure have traveled from far and wide to be here for you guys on what is a spe very, very special occasion. So before I introduce the graduation ceremony, I just want to take a few minutes to watch this video. everything that you've achieved to get to this point. Now, I promise not to keep you too long today, as this is all about you. It's about the hard work and effort that each of you has put in during your studies. And of course, it's about celebrating those accomplishments. I often say that pride and passion are in the DNA of Edinburgh College. And as I look across this wonderful venue, I see pride in the faces of all those of you who have come to celebrate with your family today. I see passion in a group of graduates who now have the world at their feet. And I have no doubt that you will go on to do and achieve extraordinary things. Since this venue was built over 100 years ago, there have been many inventions discovered and developed right here in Scotland, many even in Edinburgh, our wonderful capital city, which have changed the world. When McEwen Hall was constructed in the 1980s, there was no such thing as television, there was no penicillin, there was no radar, there was no iron brew, Imagine a world without iron brew. Over 100 years from now, I can only begin to imagine the inventions that people will be looking back on. But what I do know is that the people in this room, armed with a college education, have the potential and the talent to change the world. You just need to do it. If you look up at the dome that's above us, you may see an inscription which reads, Wisdom is the principal thing. There forget wisdom, and with all thy getting, get understanding. To me, wisdom and understanding are integral components of education. The staff who are here to celebrate alongside you have imposed their wisdom on each of you, and with your understanding, you can now take that wisdom and make of it what you will. All of you are here today, and are leaving us with hopefully more wisdom than you joined us, and guided by that wisdom, knowledge, and understanding, which can help you move mountains. There are no limits to what can be achieved, 
So my one ask of you is not to limit yourselves. You know what you're good at. You know what excites you. You know what you're talented at. And you've got something to offer society. And you have a responsibility to yourself to find out what that is. It may be hard to remember, but I was once in your shoes at my own graduation ceremony, and I remember the excitement of not quite knowing what my path in life would take next. I felt slightly fearful of the unknown, but knowing that I was equipped with the qualifications and the ambition to succeed. I had a fire in my belly which would fuel my future, even when I faced the knocks along the way, and believe you, I, I, I did, and keep your fire burning and you won't go wrong. Now, before I wrap up and we get to the good bit, there's one piece of parting wisdom that I would like to give all of our graduates today, and that is that time is all that you truly have that is yours, so please don't waste it. Invest in it wisely, whatever your plans are for the future. You only have one life, so live it well. Follow your dreams. You've made a real investment in coming to Edinburgh College, an investment that has equipped you to meet a lifetime of challenges, so please don't waste that investment. Each of you has written yourselves into the history books of Edinburgh College. You now join an alumni who are at the top of the fields across the world. Today is a celebration of what you've achieved, but also of what is yet to come. So remember to have fun, make memories, and please do make a lot of noise. This is a celebration after all. Ladies and gentlemen, we will now commence with the presentation of the prizes and the certificates. Thank you. Good afternoon. Um, I'm Kerry Heathcote, the Head of Curriculum Planning and Performance. Um, I'm here this afternoon to present the staff awards on behalf of the learning and teaching team. So we'll commence with the PDA teaching practice in Scotland's colleges. Rosalind Gaunt. Jo Coburn. <laughs> Catherine Groat. <laughs> Nikki Lang. Fraser Payne. <laughs> Pavel Piotrowski. <laughs> and we move on to the TQFE University of Dundee Award. Patricia Bannigan. <laughs> Wojciech Hoynotsky. <laughs> Chris Coburn. Jenny Mulholland. <laughs> Taylor Wilson. <laughs> Paul 
Pauline Tate. And now we move on to the City and Guilds Level 4 Award for Professional Recognition with Licentiateship, uh, Neil Gordon. <laughs> and Marie Hunter. Mandy Purdy. <laughs> Stephanie Tanner. Thank you. I also have the honour of presenting a special recognition award, if I can invite Anne Landles, the acting chair of the board, onto the stage. And this special recognition award um, is being bestowed upon Ian Young, who's been the vice chair of the board since 2012. So if I can invite Ian Young. Now hand over to Sarah Jane Linton. It's my great pleasure as head of faculty with the CMs and lecturers that have inspired you today to come to your graduation. And to that end, I'd like to present to you principal for the award of HND Accounting, Elizabeth Davies. Agnieszka Dubiel. <laughs> Fatima El Hanzuri. <laughs> Evelina Engel. Isabella Golubievska. Marlene Gonzalez. Sara Hadir. Maria Kovakova. <laughs> Patricia Kravchak. <laughs> Patricia Krukowska. Magdalena Kumar. <laughs> Priemslav Lipa. <laughs> Anna Lukanova. Lauren McNally. <laughs> Alana Miller. <laughs> Mar 
Marta Novakowska. Jake Owens. Barbara Piana. Marek Rydlewski. Lena Stadnik. Agnieszka Okmanovic. Laszlo Vartas. Magdalena Zielinska. And Principal for the Award of HNC Administration and Information Technology, Saima Jabin. Malgorzata Kalan. Bryce Lata Potel. Marion McInnes. Ertiza Mafuz. Dion McLaughlin. <laughs> Olga Algara Amrush. Katarzyna de Souza. Julie Easton. Margie Lorena Guarnazino. Lewis Lockhart. Anita Pakma Kozakevich. <laughs> Bozena Pakma Nadolska. <laughs> Alexandra Pasevich. Amrit Singh. <laughs> Honorata Tsuk. <laughs> and Principal for the Ward of HNC Business, Leanne Ayton. Carolina Hood. <laughs> Louise Smith. <laughs> and Principal for the Award of HND Business, Lara Duncan.
Bridget Eshilama. Sonam Hariramani Taibi. Emma Hoffman. Nikki Mutsis. Lorenzo Pastura. Jennifer Smith Avomo. And principal for the award of HNC Human Resource Management, Kim Holland. And for the award of HND Human Resource Management, Scott Fairgrave. <laughs> Fern Johnson. <laughs> Svetlana Krupenko. Justina Kuyavska. <laughs> Emma Liddell. <laughs> Leslie Macbeth. Joanne McLean. <laughs> Rochelle Stewart. <laughs> and principal for the award of HNC Legal Services, Jade Brown. Sarah Cameron. Amazing. And principal for the award of HND Legal Services, Sarah Boyle. Rachel Duff. Elzbieta Tomasik. <laughs> and for the award of HNC Marketing Communications, Zara Akhtar. <laughs> Alicia Horn. David Middleton. <laughs> and principal for the award of CMI Level 5 Diploma in Management and Leadership, Chloe Delgleish. <laughs> Kirsty McGill. David Nimmo. And Principal for the Ward of CIPD Intermediate Diploma in HRM, Rebecca Cameron. <laughs> Diane Clunder.
Montana Colorado Rangel. Clear Hill. Agnishka Malars. Emma McKeeb. Lee McComish. Wendy McGleed. Ryan Mean. Zoe Proudfoot. Amy Stanger. Ross Evan Taylor. Kirsty Wilkie. And principal for the award of HNC hairdressing, Adele Barlow. <laughs> Lisa Black. <laughs> Amanda Brown. Elsa McCallum. <laughs> Kaylee Moyes. <laughs> Sally Ritchie. Joanna Adamska. Sarah Ali. Lee Anderson. Ineth Blakovich. <laughs> Rebecca Brody. <laughs> Maria Klimchuk. Olivia Koldowska. <laughs> Paulina Litvin. <laughs> Chloe Meredith. Veronica Pranchvelush. <laughs> Courtney Rankin. <laughs> Amara Shoib.
Yvonne White. And principal for the award of HND Beauty Therapy, Gadir Arkoub. Zora Belhaj. Justina Jenkowska. Laura Galloway. Ailey Lawson. Shannon McDougall. Bernadette Nisbet. Ivana Tenedor Solsona. Monica Isabella Visoka. And principal for the award of HND Hospitality Management, Jessica Armitage. Declan Brown. Kelsey Halliday. Emma Hamilton. Irina Krivichaka. Rebecca Lisk. <laughs> Yanping Liu. <laughs> Anita McCauley. Lauren Miller. <laughs> Stephanie Noble. <laughs> Mikal Proust. Lisa Stevenson. Sarah Jane Tate. Rachel Wood. And principal for the award of HNC Events Management, Mia Fulton. And principal for the award of HND Events Management, Anna Beshusian. Lauren Carnahan. Megan Cook. <laughs> Beth Farker. <laughs> Anne 
Andrew Fraser. Rebecca Gale. Lauren Grant. <laughs> Stephanie Hatch. <laughs> Zoe Hogg. Kerry Hutchison. <laughs> Rachel Jack. <laughs> Charlotte Lambie. Kerry McGee. <laughs> Robbie McCarty Reed. <laughs> Lindsay Meakin. Sheila Meza Burgos. <laughs> Lorena Morales. <laughs> Shelley Murray. Heather Purdy. <laughs> Hanan Safi. <laughs> Cameron Smith. Megan Stewart. <laughs> Chelsea Thewlis. <laughs> Paulina Turzinska. Liam Wright. And for the award of HND Retail Management, Carlos del Castillo Gomez. Stephen Murphy. And for the award of HNC Travel and Tourism with Airport and Airline Operations, Louise Baxter. <laughs> Neve Douglas. <laughs> Isla Gibb. Shia Manansala. <laughs> Charlie McKendry. <laughs> 
Fabiane Neves da Silva. Natalia Pierkashka. Justine Planas. Hannah Sanchez. Fiona Sharp. Eden Simpson. Eleni Tsirika. Kara Walker. Vanessa Bachard. Mam Kumba Hobe. Rachel Nata. Rafael Ruolt. Charlotte Stewart. Danielle Telfer. Ilaria Tocacelli. Zach Tracy. And our final graduate, Ronnie Rose Villacorta. This part of our ceremony um, is about our special awards, of which we have four, um, and the principal will stay to present this first award, which is the Principal's Award for Academic Excellence in Tourism, Hospitality and Business. This student's commitment and enthusiasm for retail management shone through in all of their academic work throughout their course, always going the extra mile to produce work of the highest quality as well as going to extraordinary lengths to gain valuable insight and develop their knowledge. The winner of this year's Principal Award for Academic Excellence in Tourism, Hospitality and Business is Stephen Murphy. For our next award, I'd like to ask our Acting Chair, Anne Landles, to come to present. Thank you. The Chair's Award for Academic Excellence in Tourism, Hospitality and Business. So, a crucial part of the nomination process for today's awards involves students being nominated by their lecturers, the people who know them best. And it is important to note today that the winner of this next award was nominated by the late Lorna Wright, known to us as Lorna McLean, our much loved and respected enterprise and commerce lecturer for over a decade with our college. Lorna sadly passed away on the 13th of September and our funeral service this week was filled with staff and students paying their respects to a wonderful woman. So it's in Lorna's memory that I award this next prize. 
The recipient of this award has been described as diligent, hardworking and highly motivated throughout their three years at college. Their personal qualities helped them bring a diverse group of students together, enabling them to get the best out of themselves as well as those around them. So it's my pleasure, in Lorna's memory, to present the Chair Award for Academic Excellence in Tourism and Hospitality to Scott Fairgrieve. Well done, Scott. I would like to ask James Thompson to come to the stage to present the next award. Um, James is a, a long supporter of the college, um, himself a former colleague of one of our um, well-known curriculum leaders who can't seem to get a picture taken the same as everyone else does at a graduation ceremony, James. Um, James, um, the owner of the Preston Field and many other famous establishments, created this award for our learners. Um, this student wowed James with a panel of judges during an interview process at his five-star Preston Field House, where they showcased their talents and experience and demonstrated all they have to offer the hospitality industry. And it's with great pleasure that I announce the winner of this year's James Thompson Award is Sarah Jane Tate. And for our final award, I'd like to ask the principal to return our Marston Citizenship Award. So we've got a team as the winner of this one. You'll see the four names um, in your programme. Together, these four event students, otherwise known as all-star events, created an opportunity for hundreds of young people across Edinburgh and the Lothians to take part in sport. They organised a football tournament which brought together over 1,000 people, including children from 15 primary schools in Edinburgh and the Lothians, for a day of football, community building and fun. Friends and families and even ex-professional footballers supported the event, which was a huge success. So much so that another event for 2020 is already in the pipeline. The winners of this year's Marston Citizens Award are Andrew Fraser, Florence Trussler, April Moore and Kerry Hutchison. And I'd like to invite Andrew and Kerry to come up to the stage to collect the award on behalf of the All Star Events team. Thank you. And thank you to the principal and the chair. That concludes our graduates for today. Thank you. Graduates, ladies and gentlemen, it just leaves me to say thank you so much for making this a wonderful ceremony in such a wonderful uh, location. So I hope you've enjoyed the presentations today. And I would just like to do a final thanks, if I may, to the staff who've organised the three graduations that we're having today, which is a big job to do, so thank you to those staff. And also, and importantly, thanks very much to the staff who've come here today, who've been responsible for teaching you guys. So congratulations, well done.